orders are as follows. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to our Baldur's Gate 3 playthrough. Where uh, before we head on, I just want to quickly point out what I did off screen because let's just say I did a bit of spring cleaning, <laughs> so to speak, since well, spring is coming anyway. Uh, and yeah, I have like 16k gold, and this is because I went through all the items that I had and I sold. I think maybe like half of them, even like uh, really named swords. I, th I think I sold Jorgos Great Sword as well, for example, and more items. Even the Susur Dagger, I think I it was one of the ones I sold. I mainly sold the items that did not give anything more in terms of like stats or side things. For example, Bow the Banshee, we have the emission on hit, possibly infl inflicting frightened. Any item that didn't have anything extra, just the damage and the proficiency unlocks for that weapon, got sold. Anything that uh, has, for example, like you see here on the bow, something that does something extra, I kept. Although not all of them, I did so sell some of these items that have something extra. But most of them that don't exactly pertain to how all my characters are built. For example, most of the items that uh, gave it anything extra, like to unarmed attacks, I sold them. And more or less, that didn't quite offer a good synergy with what I had. The, then I decided, okay, no, I'm gonna sell them as well. There's no point. Uh, there's still a decent uh, amount of items left. So in case I want to swap around, I can swap around. Plus, I'm pretty sure we're gonna find more later down the road and whatnot. Now, in terms of changes, I did decide to go for the Bone Spike Garb for Karlak. Still the same armor class remaining. Constitution. Now, if I take the Gloves of Dexterity off, drops by 3 point. So I'm curious if if the rest of the set, I mean, makes sense to be the helmet, armor, boots, and gloves. So I'm curious how good are the bone spike gloves, because I might actually decide to just keep these ones, because gives dexterity and then three armor class for that one. And the armor that was on Kalak, I decided to give on Halsin, so he's wearing that, and I think I swapped. One of the gloves, I think. That I think I sold them afterwards. I think I give the one that gives guiding bolt, and I think kind of gives unarmed attack or something extra. Well, yeah, Halcyon has that one. No, 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 no. With all that said, I'm a bit. Uh, annoyed that I kind of have to do this I think I have to do this is I think I'm gonna make a beeline for all the murder, murder targets so I'm gonna have some of the map explored and I'm gonna just gonna ignore most of these things I do however and I wanna try for this one stop the presses because I'm not right next to it and then we go more the, more the target Frank we haven't talked. Interesting enough that these two guys that I already talked with, they still appear on the map. I did uh, speak with Rover off screen, off screen and she just said like, oh, don't worry, I'll keep an eye out for any suspicious blah, blah, blah. But nothing else afterwards, you know, for to make this, you know, disappear from the map. Like, okay, you already talked with him, you know, alerted him, whatever, it's all good. But yeah, we're gonna go for Frank, and then by the looks of it, then double back up the north, where was the wine festival? Looks like straight line, no more the targets are in the north, and then it's just gonna be close by where, where I have saved Vandra as well. So I might stumble upon that one to do the quest to save Vandra. And then alert these two guys, and then we end up here. We'll see. But I do want 
to do the presses. Now, I was thinking there are a couple of things that I could I could do. One, either try with Asterion and may go invisible and whatnot. It's by the fact that this, you know, it's locked, so I do have to lock pick. Unfortunately, so let's just ungroup. Time for discretion. How come you see me? Right, never mind. Is that or not? somebody else is seeing no, me. Never mind. Hey ho. While I'm at it. At the ready. Well, this can be hopefully easily solved right. if no. for example myself, let's just go to the guard. Posting, I suppose. Beats guard in the docks. Place reeks. I'm glad you asked. It would certainly help with right. the dishes. Right, Stallion. <laughs> Who okay. is after the joke? You're okay, who else is seeing me? Him some time and then... There we go. Let's I go. need to lock pick this really quick. Thank you, Asterion. I'm not sticking around. Right. Uh, now that is unlocked. So, either I try to do this with only Asterion. Creature attacks or cast a spell. I go for invisibility. Or, or, or. Let's get going. I wonder if the disguise, let's say screw of seeming, or even the mask of shapeshifter would work. Because if you think like this, it's not exactly our character that goes inside. So I think maybe. Okay, can we group up? Because okay. this is this guy's up to four member. And let's say I discuss myself. Ah, then I select four. <laughs> no, okay, Gail is a uh, dwarf. And it's the hand the same. <laughs> Kalek, okay, he's a buff. Darling. <laughs> no way. Gail? <laughs> Go ahead. I'm listening. Yes, you are. And it's Tarion. Yes. He looks like, really? Come on, yes. What do you want? Why, yes, Edvard. So, Can I call you Edvard? no. Will this be considered that I'm. Well, Edvard, I do support Lord Gortash's campaign. Game? For several reasons. Ah, don't tell me you crashed. Uh, I think this is my first crash ever of the game. Yep. Okay. Be back in a sec. Right. Never mind. It did not crash. Yes, yeah, so it's gonna be a bit of time, time skip. And actually, the guard says like, oh, you can't... You can't go in there. So it looks like... He still knows that I'm me. That means... Mm, do I still have... I don't think I have on myself. Attention! Elminster's not around, so might as well. Is this gonna... Right, how do I get rid of this, actually? Ah, okay. Dispel this guys. So this is not working. So there's no point for me to stay like this. Because they already know. Yeah. Alrighty then. Asterion. What do I think of Lord Gortash's still watch? Well, Become invisible. I am so glad you asked, Edvard. No. That's no, created to no, no, invisible no. attacks. Mr. Ends or if the creature attacks or cast a spell. Well, I'm not exactly casting the spell if I go inside. So. <laughs> okay. Like a wraith. Has a signal heard. Okay, Asterion. Okay, I 
have to go and do this rather quick. Step quick. So I need to go down there. Ready or not. Mysterian. Okay, and the thing is that it's actually kinda invisible so that's not great give all this mold gazette and protectors so where do I need to go new soccer float pouch just an empty pouch looks like it is right uh then in that case I don't need this pouch I have Plenty of pouches. Use this to collect the news hawkers. So at the end, do not. At the end of the day, and to, and to give them a change for tomorrow. Do not give Luan another float. If he keeps misplacing it, he'll have to give a change, out of his own pocket. Cool. Step carefully. Wait, is this? Take me to another area. You've set foot in a restricted area. A swift exit may be in order. Wait. Leave him some time and then. Ah, are you for real? That was the exit? Oh, crying out loud. Right. There. You should be. You yeah. don't have permission to be here. Right, uh... Yeah, I hate doing this, but I'm gonna load. Okay, so... I thought... Yeah, this is the exit. Yeah, put me in a weird... Because I started right here. That's why I got a bit confused. Okay, we do have a watcher. There's a level over here. What is this? Is this taking me out as well? Ah, it's right here. Not for communal uses. Into the ship. Okay, quick. Right. So this is actually, in a way, my exit, if you think about it. So I need to avoid this guy, then I have somebody over here. I was thinking this might be something similar, like pull, pull a lever and then you block one of these guys somewhere. Is that a door over there? Yes, it is. Okay, you're going up until there. So far, might be easy. Might. I still have one invisibility though. I don't have a short, sh uh, short rest. Stepping softly. But it looks like this should be relatively easy enough. Actually. Okay, quick. Move it. No. Okay, so that didn't happen. <laughs> right. Uh, yeah, I kind of got uh, screwed. That I got a bit greedy with these ones. But I'm curious. There's uh, something more there. So that's why. So, we try to get these ones quick. Retreat back here. Just curious, what's these newspapers? Uh, local rogue, star scales, and fun business. 
Oh, he's the same. Come on. Turn around. Thank you. And now... Sneak through. Get through the door. And then this is gonna be... Oh, actually... No, this is a bad idea. I need to see where he is. Unfortunately. Okay, then... Sneak through here. Then there. How far can you see? Looks like you cannot... See that much. Gator chest. So, as in, I have a bit of leeway. Oh, a lot of pouches. Okay, stay here. Collection records. I don't know what you're lacing in those papers. Okay. That's not. Ah, oh, okay. Gold. Does all of these have gold? Sure, I guess. And then... Yeah, I'm gonna put the pouches back. Again, I have no need for them. I have too many extras. Now, how do I time this? He's coming, alright. And this might be really, really tight. You know, one, two, three. Yeah, I don't have a lot move time so here how I'm thinking it while he's moving back there I'm gonna move to this corner and then that actually gives me a bit more time to Ooh. Oh, okay that's really close and now we move Really? Right. Uh, I was kind of forced to reload from here because I thought I had uh, I had more time. I mean, last time I counted. So he's looking like that. It's gonna turn. Really? I don't have enough time to move from here to here. Huh. Interesting. And I don't want to use... This one. Three, two, one. Okay, there we go. Embrace modernity. Okay, the dry run of the new enchanter automated. Okay. And hide over here. Okay. So that was a bit more time on that one. I'm surprised. Either maybe they have a bit more different timing and whatnot. Elder Inferno. Oh, there's a barricade over here. Uh, I guess. I mean, this would be help. 
Paul if I destroy the barricade. But isn't this gonna alert them? No. Okay. Who? Right. Uh, cutest cat you ever seen? What? I'll go on drum. And then thieves tools. Okay, and now. Oh, is there actually a door? There is. I do kind of need to see how this guy moves. And you know what's uh, interesting? That you have no music at all. Okay, so he is moving there and then turns to his left. Which means I need to take that door. And thing is, when he turns around, I mean, yeah, more than enough time, to be honest. Cool, 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 cool. I'm not gonna read those. Oh, silver ingot, yes. An instant letter from K, addressed to Lord Demer Gortash. Far be it, my lord, for me to question a decree from you, but I worry you haven't the full picture in mind. If we were to stop at all production of the Baldur's Gate or the Baldur's Mouth Gazette. K. Johnson is normal. Nothing that important. And then... Public danger. Is this actually about me? Yeah. Tale about you. So looks like we're gonna... Print about the cutest cat ever. <laughs> Official print job. Okay, you're about to find one. Well, hey. Five bundles. Alright. Now, here. I don't need actually to be careful about this other one. Now, I should have enough time, hopefully. That's curious. If you say so, Asterian, well, we don't have time. Okay. It's not funny. I don't care who keeps messing with the printer, adding mistakes into addition. Ha! <laughs> well, they're gonna have to... You're gonna have to dock a lot of pay. Gondian Research Report. Shadow Curves. Landmarks. What else? Wolves in sheep's clothing. Yeah, the same about me. So a lot of this is regarding us. Southern earthquakes. Uh, can I get this one quick? Let's see, there looks like there's some steps over there. My dearest Edward, a new gift from the Venable Glory Gartash has already outstripped. I don't know, shame. Right, nothing more. Backpack, the Duke's mouth. Alright, notice of termination. While the mouse likes to nurture another zero open, okay. You have become and are fostering a toxic and journalistic presence in the rocks. You are fired without Yeah. Curse breaker, curse maker, so let me guess this is again still about me. Yeah. 
an article mark for the editor's desk that looks like it never went to print. There's a sickness in our city, dear reader. It nibbles on our on the council's ear in private audience chambers. It clangs around our streets in steel automatons, and it whispers sweet nothings from the pages of this very broadsheet. The fetid presence of Lord Enval Cortash is rotting our city in its very core. And this reporter is personally ashamed to work for a publication, no, propaganda vehicle that allows the infection to spread. There's so much to this story, dear reader, so very much, and I'm excited to share it with you. Yes, you, Edward. Consider this my notice of resignation. Holly Falls, investigative journalist, newly freelance. Okay, what about the Gondian auto printer user manual? It's a two-step process. Step one, loading your headline article. Printing is as easy as opening a hatch and placing your desired article in the machine. Once the auto printer is loaded, it will animate and begin pumping out copies until either the ink reservoir or paper hopper, hopper is empty. Step two, endless profit. Now your exceptional journalist will be ready to deliver for delivery to your vast, vast readership. You'll need it without the, the amount of broadsheets this thing will print. Ah. <laughs> so they were like more than one step. Okay. I'm gonna have to wait for that guy. Or actually, how much into the room he sees? Not a lot. Really? You approach the printer, noting its ink splots and intricate cogs. Before you can get closer, however, it begins to speak. Oh. Oi! Gormless! Over here! Thought I recognized you. Dolly, Dolly, Dolly was right. You aren't much of a looker. Uh, how do you know Dolly? We both love cheeky words. She does all the shouting, I do the writing. This is my paintbrush. I make sure everything that's in those big, ugly article blocks becomes fine printed artistry. I'm a master pensman, I am. Dolly can't stop talking about you. <laughs> hero this, hero that, hero here, hero there. <laughs> Hello, hero. You know, there's some absolute filth about you in tomorrow's edition. Seeing oh. as you were kind enough to free Dolly, how's about I do you a favor? Why don't we change the headline? We can load up something a bit less damaging for your reputation. Oh, okay. I, I, I was thinking like, Dolly, Dolly, Dolly. I thought it was one of the reporters that I met in Rivington. Because I believe there was like some reporters. But no, Dolly, Dolly was the fae in the lantern. Ah, okay. I'm assuming you could still do this quest and convince to change the headline, the printing and whatnot. Even if you haven't freed free Dolly. But, okay. This is extra. And how do we do that? Well, first, I've got to release the old nasty top story. Look there. <laughs> now, you've got to find a new article to replace it. Well, where can I find the stuff to print a new broadsheet? Listen, mate, I'm already doing you a favor. <laughs> I'm sure you can figure it out yourself. As the old saying goes, ours is not to wonder why. Ours is but to print or die. Or something like that. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh. Okay, Gail is inspired? Huh? Uncover the machinery. Why? This is interesting. So, the party can get inspiration despite the fact that they are split up? Okay. And you said you... Put the old one out? Can I just have it? No. I'm not seeing it on the ground. Okay. Oh, you've returned. Ready to serve some discord? 
Absolutely. How delightful. Okay. So it's gonna be... Uh, where was it? Cutest cat you've ever seen. And that's the only one we can do. That's not against us, that is. Yeah. That's what the people need to know. <laughs> Check the next edition of the Baldur's Mouth Gazette. Okay. Can we chat more? Paper's printing right now, pal. Should be on the streets tomorrow. Thank you. And since I have all the others, should be fine, right? Now, we get back. And unfortunately, I have to get to this room and then afterwards go to this room. But since I have the wall destroyed, should be fine. It should be fine here in the corner, right? And three, two, one. Ah, uh, I do have enough time, right? Uh, come on. <laughs> right. That was actually much more closer than I wanted. To be honest. Uh. Okay. I'm gonna watch through there. I'll just go to the wall. And I'm gonna have to follow him. Okay, now this is taking me outside, right? Everyone has to contribute, my darling. Ah, no, he's taking me here. Tricks. Well, here we can solve this, right? Fast travel, and that should put all of us out. Nice. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, didn't like that. I had to do a lot of you know, a lot of quick loads over there. But hey, it is what it is. Okay. Now, unfortunately, not sure how much I can do from the murder quest. At least alert Frank. Let's see more about Why here. Why yes, Edvard. Not yet. Can I call you? Why yes. I'd love to do an interview. What? Oh, sorry. Thought you were one of the mouse journalists. Okay. Why would you think that? I bet that hostel lady wouldn't make you clean the dishes. The hostel's up that way. You won't find better around here, unless you can pay for it. Uh, yeah, I can reach. Oh, there's a defeated steel watcher over there. That's enough of that. So what's going on here? If this lot have got a problem with the Gazette, they should take it up with the editor, not make a scene in the streets. Okay, so what's this about then? Kind of terrifying that the likes of Lord Gortash can just decide what's true or not. Despicable. Ah, so that kind of uh, annoyance. Order's Gate's never going to be safe with the Absolute out there. Why would the Gazette lie to an entire city? The paper says we're safe here, but we're not. We may as well be outside the walls with the Absolute. No point reading the Gazette. 
You might as well be reading the walls of a tavern privy. <laughs> ah, kind of true. Here, you know. Right. Oh, what happened with this? Actually, is this and um, is this something I can enter? Why is perception failed? Come on. Something over there. Inside. Oh, this is Joel's house. No letters, no clerics, no herb sellers, no potion peddlers, and no steel watch. Watch your back. Okay. I mean, this looks like it's a small room. You've been spotted fiddling with that. Really? Who's oh, seeing me? You really? Come on. Okay, come on, quick, 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 quick. I'm literally right. <laughs> Never a diamond. Everyone else minds their business. George Chesky. Always room for more. Never wanted the easy part. I mean this chest. No? Not that one? Okay, letter from Silai. Father, I've heard about the risk of shortages in the city. I know you're absolutely unforgivable when it comes to shopping for yourself, so I've sent some victuals that could see you through a whole season if you pace yourself. Do it for me, hmm? I love you very much and will be home for a long visit before you know it, God's willing. All my love, Silai. Will you tell Kathora, Kathora, I said hello? I will send Uli your love a thousand times over. Right tool will do the trick. I should be able to unlock this on my own. Natural 20. That's everything I'm gonna take. So you just disappeared. So I wonder which what is that chest that the key is gonna unlock? A broken steel watcher. A tag wired to it reads Unit defective. Return to the steel watch foundry at the West Docks. Uh Damadalor City. Ah, okay, this is the same. We already know where the foundry is. Okay, free lock picks and. Uh, what was it? Chuck, this one, kids. Okay, this is the same with the hex for the hag. Very you much. should be a vendor, right? Do you know how hard it was to get those cabbages into the city? No, you're impossible. Oh no, your cabbages. <laughs> also, yeah, we're close to Gale's quest. But again, I'm gonna try to. Oh, area under investigation? Maintain your distance. Area under active investigation by order of the Flaming Fist. Why don't we just. We're not lost. Just taking in the view before continuing on our way. Okay. The lower cities are bloody Warren. I'm surprised anyone can find their way around. What do you mean this area is under? Ah, you mean this Can't house? My hand on everything. Directions. No, no, you mustn't. Oh. The city is full of criminals. We can't let them know. Okay, a soul coin over there. Sure, I'll take that one. But I need to get inside here. Uh, are people okay if I break this? So far, nobody's saying anything. Oh, I think this guy is already dead. Yep. Free. Crossbow, there's a hatch actually here. Those planks. 
Those wishing to face the Dread Lords Tribunal enter the Temple of Baal must slay the targets, okay? Kill, killed. Left, left, right. Ah, free, okay. Uh, don't I have an Alexander as well? They're already gone, so Korra. Uh, chef. Right? Yeah, more the Tariq Alexander. I think this guy is gone as well. Which only leaves Figaro. So we said, well, uh, at least I saved Cora. I alerted the chef. Figaro is where we need to go to follow the killer as well. And then. Ah, there's two guys in Upper City. Can we get there though? We might not get there. This is just extra. So it's only Nisha. Because I think, yeah, Alexander killed. Wonderful. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, Bloody note. Is this hash gonna. the keys for the hatch, but it's for the chest. Ah, oh, come on. I mean, yeah, no, I can even block it with the stadium, but... Okay, pile of books. Courageous lethal. What's hiding here? That's that not lethal. is huge. And is that a burning heart? And looks like Clowns. more oh. Jubos the Clown. No doubt. Yeah. Long sword. Sure, I'll take it just to have it. Very short day. Okay, there's unleashed. I think already read that one on offer. Dear Mr. Peer Tree, you come highly recommended by a select few, not merely for your business acumen, but also for your ambition. This is why I'm writing to you a question of ambition. I have in my possession a tremendous quantity of infernal iron. Its acquisition is immaterial. What matter is this? I shall need assistance distributing the weapons forged from this exquisite iron. I shall need someone ambitious. Someone with less than scrupulous connection. Someone, Mr. Peer Tree, like yourself. That Mr. Peer Tree was the carrot. I often find it makes an excellent bedfellow to the stick. Consider your position. A less than scrupulous set of connections doesn't just make you valuable to me. It would also make you invaluable to any number of upstart city watchmen or flaming feast ready to make rank. It would really be a tra terrible tragedy for such bright potential to be extinguished in this way. I eagerly await your correspondence. Yours in fate and well got dash. Okay, and then Cassie. Nothing. Right, what did I get? Yeah, long sword, that's gonna be sold. Severed arm. That's an entire arm by the looks of it. Torso, which looks is the hand. Yeah, the right one. Or the left side looks like. <sighs> Does not exactly look like it's a uh, in Fully intact, but let's say it is a bit more longer. And then the hand is the left one, connects here, and then the pelvis. So I just need the legs and the head by the looks of it. Okay, what about that's the pass? Yagashura the second, the effigy of Yagashura who burned his mortality. What use his heart? He thought himself a titan, but died whispering for his mother. Or in the red, okay, and then. You've been picking where you shouldn't, Miss Peer Tree. Placing the Lordlings' fire spitters throughout my city. Disgusting. They leave no blood. There's no art to it at all. Just burnt ash and corpse cinder. I walk through your basement here as I pen this. It's rather large, roomy. They never find all the bits of you if I spread them around here properly. 
So this guy was really a giant. Oh, his stats is 10 across the board. He's human. Size medium. Maybe enlarging potion then? Okay, there's the wooden chest. Ah. There's some gold. Is there any other chest? As weapon sales ledger. What else? Short ball. Just some weapons that I can pick up and just sell. Open up. Ah. Strong boss? Yes. Ooh, two soul coins. Half plate. Unfortunately. This I can actually sell as well, in my opinion. But yeah, those uh, soul coins is gonna help. And I like hold on to these ones. Well, well, well. Wasn't there? Yeah, there ahead. was another long sword green. Oh, that will fit in my pack. I'll take the greens Swift at least. Making me sweat. And these things have stayed interesting. Okay, so looks like I can't ready. exactly save everybody. They're already dead. So at least one more. He's already dead. Wonderful. I'm going to ask for directions. No, no. Okay, so that's that. That's the hack survivors. Let's. Back up. So maybe at least see once. with Alexander. Whoa! What the? God uh, damned hypocrites! Uh, the blade of frontiers, all pomp and empty oaths. The Sword Coast's most dashing fraud. You are either a fool for trusting him, or a wretch for conspiring with him. Doesn't matter which. Lady um, Mazora told me everything. How Will slaughtered his own father. How he craves his power. How he means to make the city bow to him and him alone. This city holds no place for you or for Raven Guard's treacherous spawn. Uh, whoa, 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 hold up, hold up. Um, uh, what is this? Any chance or in again? Okay, I'm gonna try to do a history first. Is that my uh, give me more options? You remember the stories of Elturel's fall? The city was dragged into the hells at Zariel's behest, and Ravenguard along with it. But yeah, I'm gonna go for persuasion. Rave God will still be alive, and we intend to save him. Okay, friends. Uh, not a big roll, though. At ease. By the living gods, I believe you. What darkness has fallen upon us? There's something you must know. I should have told Will sooner, but. I'd hoped somehow Ravenguard would return to us. He knew about the Absolute. I thought little of it at first, but he realized the danger before anyone else did. He understood that if the cult were successful in raising an army, Boulder's Gate would be doomed. Before the Absolute has subducted him, he told me that should he fall, I should seek Will out and give him a message. Will was schooled in the ways of the great champions. He is to use those lessons to wake the worm sleeping beneath Boulder's Gate. The worm is oath-bound to answer the call and come to the city's aid. A worm? Are you saying there's a dragon living under the city? A bronze dragon, yes. He sleeps beneath us even now. 
awaiting a hero to rouse him. The worm goes by many names. An Sur, the waiting storm, the heart of the gate. He promised Baldurin he'd protect the city if ever its existence was threatened. But just the once. The city has faced countless threats. But Ravenguard knew it could not survive the absolute slaughter. With him gone and the city near ruin, the worm's awakening now falls to you and Will. The Duke gave me this. A legend of Ansur, an ancient epic, ill-remembered, dismissed as a mere tale. Let it set the path before you, or do not, and see Baldur's Gate burn to ash. Your fate is well founded. I will take your message to Will. Thank you. In darkness, I see your light. I should go. I know of still others that might help us when the battle horns call. Unleash the worm. Let his tempest swallow the Absolute and its allies. And may they be driven forever from the coast. Okay, well that happened. Didn't... Okay, right. Uh, this is for Dribbles, Blade of Frontiers. Council of Floric. I did not have Will with me, so I wonder how that would have worked. Using Will of killing his father so he could take over the city. In my opinion, we should have a still watch in every Baldurian. We should read that, okay. Why? I'm glad you asked. Legend of Ansur. Baldur's Gate, Great Baldurian's Birth, O Balduran, Founder, Do Veneration, His Guardian Dragon and Sewer. Tremendous in worth. A savior below our eternal elation. To worms ray need freeze and deepest level to be found not by solo nor devil. Entrance in worms rock prison with a lightning shock that purchases a light. Something about sparks and torches use lightning skills. Its trials no common adventure may exceed. Wait. Worms rock. What's this of a true hero Okay. But I think we already been there, right? Uh, I don't have... Yeah, I think I already... Been there, it was the one with the trials. Interesting. So I just need to finish one more that one trial and that's it. I'll never understand people who don't want to be famous. The more the people like you, the more you can get away with. And I think I can talk with Lolo. So that happened. Right. Uh murder target Alexander. Let's see with him. I should speak uh, anything up. interesting happening here? Do you mind? I'm in the middle of an interrogation. Okay. Ooh. Vendor. Come get your copy of the Baldur's Mouth Gazette. When the mouth speaks, the city shakes. All right there, Chief. Can I interest you in a copy of our fine, fine broadsheet? Uh, no, Suit thank yourself. you. If you change your mind, I'll be here all... Well, all the time, really. Who is casting what? Salamander. Ah, uh, looks like that might be something important. The waypoint is covered. Uh, which way will it be? Maybe this way? Not really liking it. I'm uh, skipping so much around here. Getting 
this way. And then in this way. Whoa, what the? Oh, uh, hi, hello. What happened? And ah, the heart-stopping bloodsucker. Ever since our last liaison, I haven't been able to get you out of my mind. Right. <laughs> Nor have I, no matter how hard I try. <laughs> Forgive the mess. Your blood is far more volatile than I'd anticipated. Ah, uh, our blood cause that ex explosion it's a breakthrough in the sanguine arts the likes of which the world has never seen the grand matriarch will have no choice but to restore house Oblodra after i present her with my research but listen to me rabbiting on about myself when i have you the prize bleeder on my very doorstep if you'd come inside we could discuss something far more exciting than drow politics. Um. Sure, why not? Yes. That is, do follow me. Inspiration on Gale, alright. I mean, you're still a vendor. That's curious. Yeah, get the mess. E for the hatch. Deep breaths, laddie. You'll be right in no time. Let's keep your hands to your. Wait, there's not the key for. Okay. So. Ah! A cozy little spot, isn't it? These four walls have witnessed greater alchemical triumphs. Then the keep of Erngath Durand. And now that you're here, the crown jewel of my research is soon to be faceted. All you have to do is drink Formula Gruner. Um, I trust is... you haven't forgotten what happened when I drank something she offered. This formula won't be any kinder to you. What will this formula do? When you first entered this home, you saw the incredible latent power within your blood exposed in all its nuances. Formula Gruner will unleash that power within you. Risky, but, um, safe. Right. I can probably handle a little fire, but I'm not sure about the rest of you. What else can you tell me about it? Well, yes. Formulae Arku through Fruag were spectacular failures. But Gruner... Gruner is different. <laughs> Believe me. Ah, so this is... Alpha, Beta... So A, B, C, D... <laughs> so this is like, what, Mark 7? Of the formula? Or something like that? Okay, sure, hand it over. Oh, marvelous. I've never been so excited for anything in all my days. Just stand over there, far over there, and drink up. Do I have to? Wait, this doesn't give me a quest. And the first round can be on you. Yeah, so where do you want me to stay? How so delicious. Mysterian. Okay, looks like I have to lockpick this one. Unless she has the key on her. So. Actually, yeah. What do you have on you? Just out of curiosity. Uh, you have the gold. I think you. He'll have the stuff that I sold to her. Uh, you do have some potions. 
I'm gonna take the potions. That's for sure. <laughs> then I doubt I can take. Uh, Nice, thank you for the gold as well. Right. So you didn't see anything, okay? Shh. <laughs> Whoa, what the? Uh, hi, hello? There's nothing here, guys. Not as bad as it could have. Crimes being investigated in this area. You appear to be the prime suspect. I investigated the same crime. Leave it to me. Shh. You'll walk free for now. Can you just leave? Thank you. Right. Uh, wooden hatch. Trap the sound wall kit. That's. Oh, that's actually crafting materials. With haste. Oh, pockets. What are you going? It's a trap. Right. Holy moly. Of course. God damn it. I'm gonna use inspiration for this. He has a lot of stuff over here. Damn. Other side. Mind reading, sure. So the adventure gave me was a rare find. It is hot, ready, and yielding. She was doing a lot of experiments. Right, that makes it think uh, it was kind of a bad idea. That uh, we gave the the blood. Right. Should have listened to you, Asterian, but you know, curiosity killed the cat. And all that. With a flick of the wrist. Wait, is it this the chest that I picked up the key. But didn't I pick it up with my own character? I'm not really feeling bad that I took all the cash from her. Okay, so that's everything here, more or less. Just keep your hands to yourself. You being. Yep, no worries. I'm keeping my hands for myself. Uh, right. Should I stay here? Oh, I thought this was a crafting material. I guess it's not. Okay, bottoms up. Yes, but you do go down in history if your citizens die of thirst. So, oh my, my heavens, you lived! This is incredible. I'm seeing stars. You seem surprised. Had you expected me to die? I'd hypothesized you wouldn't, my friend. And you've proven me absolutely correct. You are the world's first detonative exsanguinator. To put it simply, from this day on, your blood goes boom. Big um. boom. <laughs> it's incredible. What do you mean by that? All it needs is a spark. Uh, is this going to kill me? Certainly not. 
But it might do damage to anyone who makes you bleed without your express permission. And naturally, I always ask first. I'm civilized, unlike you. <laughs> of course you are. There are other necks available for biting, of course. If you were so inclined. Can you reward it? What an odd question. Now, let me offer you a little treat. In exchange for the teensiest vial of your marvelous blood, I'll give you something that'll really throw your enemies for a loop. I'll only ask a nominal fee in exchange. Sure, whatever. You really are a fine collaborator. Uh, ah, is this just so... Well, since I'm here... Well, you don't have gold. <laughs> Oops. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I already took your gold. <laughs> uh, yeah, sure, thank you. Until next time. We survived the effects of... Oh. Oh. So... Wait, where, where am I going, guys? I thought I lost control of my character. So, is this gonna be... A feat over here? This resistance, Hunter's Eye... Unstable blo blood. Your blood is now highly flammable and it will explode in contact with fire. Wait a minute. What's on your mind? Does that mean I cannot? Okay, let's give it a test. Go on. Because she has fire on her, right? So that means I should go boom. I was hoping you'd say that. Uh, in a way. It's not exactly our blood making contact, so... Okay, nothing is happening. So, yeah, it shouldn't happen anything because... It's not exactly making contact, our blood. But if we bleed... And we... <laughs> get intimate... <laughs> <laughs> we get intimate with Kalak... Then, yeah. That would be interesting. Okay. Uh, I'm next to. Just. Molotov, yeah, Alexander should be here. I'm sorry, I can't help you. This is the private abode of Alexander Rainforest. Friends make appointments. Clients respect office hours. Uh, huh. Okay, so if I go to the main door, people will be upset. But. Okay. okay, what about this door over here? General goods, okay. I have a chest. I'm gonna talk with him and maybe sell some stuff. What are you after, friend? Got grub, potions, a few nice vintages? Best stock up now before someone clears me out to fill their larder. Let's see what you have. Uh, you have tips, tools. No, I don't need barter. And you have potions. Looks like I'm gonna have to rearrange the potions off screen again. But you can have this one, and that's pretty much it. Yeah, because the rest was crafting materials. Okay. Anything else, actually? It's invisibility, poisons and resistance. I 
yourself get that one. And I'll drink it myself. At least I'll have a level 3 spell slot. Bolski, we're all right. Please tell me there's a door somewhere. It is. Ah, but this is Death's called home. That should be locked. I'm not exactly making a connection to where I need to go. Ouch. Can you believe my oldest baby girl just had her own baby girl? Aww. And I just robbed him. <laughs> oh boy. And then cookies. Yeah, this is doubling back. Sure, I'll have this one lock pick just in case. Ah, that's an 11. Okay, maybe I should get the Starion for this. I'm fine. Uh, I have plenty of lock pick tools, to be honest. Uh, I was hoping for a door or a balcony. I mean, there is one way I can solve this. I'm not sure. I do have a potion. And I do know Gale as well has. So, I'm just gonna... Eat it. Traveler's chest. Don't give me Have you seen any gazetteers or something? Maybe see the new additions out of Natural 20. If you ask me, much safer this side of the city walls. Here I'm for home. Yep, there he is. Night. I'm worried about you got to deep okay, conspiracy. Ahead. Some friends wanted to meet with him. Okay. Oh, there's a rat here. There's a plate. What's that? Plus the imposhment. There we go. So that's still the same list. What's with you over here? Hello, hello. Ooh, are you the new cheese dropper? I do hope so. I'm almost down to the last crumbs. Wait, what happened to the last one? Alexander was his name. He dropped all manner of morsels, but the cheeses were the best until the red man visited. Tell me more about this red man. A dwarf, all dressed in red. He smiled and held Alexander closer, and then Alexander was shouting and struggling, and soon he was all dressed in red as well. So many red morsels fell out of Alexander. They tasted like salt and rust. Very good. Even better than cheese. Yeah, right. Do you realize you ate Alexander's innards? Yes. Tasty. He didn't need them anymore. <laughs> Go away now. Your delicious scent makes me crave your morsels. But it would be rude to bite you. No, can we get more? Hold up. You smell like a feast. What? Okay, you're not... This is a... Step carefully. There's a trap. Okay. 
more. Uh, okay. I'm gonna use an inspiration for this. Step carefully. There's a trap. Clown several foot. Okay. Foot. Paint. Uh, Jibbles foot, or at least one of them. Right. Uh, the future of goal is. Okay. Let us call reversal. Bottle breath. Okay. Mm Chest, some arrows. Ocean dice, I'm not gonna bother taking. A lot have been watching that tombstone spot for 10 days now. Weird. And show up. Uh, looks like these guys weren't exactly that good. Looks like they were scoping out the places. Ow. That happened. A couple turns should do. Uh, I guess I missed the. Uh, Key somewhere. Okay, not a bad amount of gold. Looks like this is it. Right, I'll just have this one unlocked just to have it. Need 15, got 15. And I don't think there was. Yeah, there was nothing else. No, 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 no. I don't know where I jumped, but whatever. Uh, okay, that happened. <laughs> I don't know how I dropped, but sure. Okay, so that's... Alexander, what's left of him? Then we have Nisha, and I looks like we might do save Vanra at the same time, by the looks of it. And then yeah, finally catch up with the murderer. Hopefully, maybe save Figaro. We will see. But for now, I'll leave it here for this episode, and. See how it goes. I might. Actually, not sure what I can clear around here. Than foxes, and all through the hey, good looking. Uh, yeah, well, uh, I'll see. I'll organize a bit more off screen the Despite inventory, it. the potions of healing that I got. And yeah, we'll continue next time. So, hope you enjoyed this episode, guys. But as always, don't forget to take care.